Hi everybody. So I've been doing a story about um, going back to school or going back to college. And so I thought I would just do a video to kind of start bringing some of those things together in groups, just to make it a little easier to understand and see what I'm talking about from just pictures. So one of the first things I suggested, some of you, whether you like it or not, some of you aren't wearing masks. Some of you are choosing to wear masks and some of you are being forced to or asked to um, to wear masks depending on where you're located. So for those of you that do have to wear masks, we have these aroma rings. Now they either come in lavender or aroma ease, which is like a nice gentle one that I will diffuse or rub on my belly just to, for all those kind of um, needing to relax. So if you're worked up about something or not liking it or feeling a little bit queasy, I will definitely use the Aroma Ease. That's the one Michael uses a lot when he goes to work because he has to wear a mask 20, 12 hours a day, not 24, but 12 hour shifts that he does. And inside you have like a little nose ring. Now what we do, these nose rings are usable or reusable. You can reload them with the same aroma or whatever aroma that you choose to have. And I don't know if you can actually see them right here. The little tiny thing, and all you do, you just clip it into your nose, like that. So you can hardly ever see them. And when they're in your mask, you definitely can't see them. And so that takes out a lot of nice aroma. Smelling it now, but when you're in clothes in a mask, especially if you've had coffee or some other flavors, you do not want to be rebreathing. This definitely makes it so much more pleasant. And that's how I and the children, um, use especially when we're going to go on an airplane we're going to have to wear our masks and so this is what we're going to be doing and to reload them you can just put them in a glass a little wine glass i have like a little mason jar pop them in there at the end of the day you just put in one drop of your chosen oil put the lid back on to seal everything in and in the morning take it back out again and start going again um, some people just put it into a glass and you can just leave the drop to absorb everything within an hour. It all depends on your needs. But we kind of, at the end of the day, take it off, put it in there, and it's ready for the next day. So I'm just gonna take this out right now. So the other thing, um, that's one thing you definitely have to do with the whole mask thing. Um, keeping yourself clean. Hand sanitizers, there's been a lot of talk of, and things have been taken off shelves for some of the nasty toxic ingredients that are found in hand sanitizers. So thankfully a few things are changing, but I will not be using the hand sanitizer that is found all over the place from the child, my children <laughs> and I. What I keep in my purse is the Thieves hand sanitizer and it kills 99.99% .99 of all those nasty germs out there. And we wash our hands whenever you can. When you can't, this is waterless, you don't need it. So it's perfect in, um, in your purse. It's really cute and easy to, to use. Um, you can even give these to your kids, put them in their backpacks. There's some little backpack or holders for them that you can just tie onto the, the backpacks to make them nice and easy and accessible. And it's a great way of keeping your hands clean throughout the day without putting poison stuff on your skin, which goes into your system. The other one I posted about was the Thieves Wipes. In here you get 30 wipes in a kind of hard, um, very light though. So you can put them into your purse, keep them in your car. I personally don't keep them in my car because in Texas when it's like over 100 degrees and our cars get real hot, I don't like leaving anything in there necessarily. Though I always do have a hand sanitizer in there um, just because you need that when you're on the go, especially with children. This is great for wiping down anything. So when you're at a restaurants or wherever, um, in stores, like the shopping carts or whatever you need that you're kind of, you need wiping or cleaning, or you drop something, um, this will definitely be going with us on the airplane. It goes with us when we're on vacation. Um, then that also you can, um, the thieves spray. And this is another thing you can do down surfaces wherever you go. So when we're not staying in a hotel, I've got something real quick and easy to clean down everything that I need. I always have one of these in my purse too, because if I don't have the hand sanitizer or something, you need something extra, you just use that. Um, the other thing with Thieves, because this kind of got the Thieves theme, is our Thieves essential oil. Now, many of you have heard 
about our thieves essential oil that's what got st you started with using essential oils especially in the winter months but right now any time of the year they're perfect and what we do in our house you can diffuse it you can um, put it on you get the vitality you can take it internally my husband makes me a hot toddy that includes some whiskey and thieves some lemon and maybe a bit of honey it really um, gets what you need to get done um, and, and tastes quite nice actually we put it in hot drinks we like cook with it in that sense but for your children and hence the going back to school or college you can put it into like a rollerball you can even put a rollerball on top of this but it's so hot you need to dilute it with a carrier oil so that could be like your olive oil or your coconut like fractured fractionated coconut oil so it doesn't um, still nice and runny or we use like the v6 the vegetable oil from young living which is six different vegetable oils um, that are much better than some other oils that you get out there and we you can put it in here like with 20 drops of um, your thieves essential oil fill up the rest with the, the carrier oil so that's your what we call the kitchen oil you can also put in a few drops of oregano essential oil as well just to give it that extra little kick and then you can this is when i tickle my girls at night i will roll it on their feet i will roll it up and down their spine and there are reasons why i do that and it tickles them but i also don't get it all over my hands however if i don't if we run out of this and i haven't refilled it because that's one i will keep making i get like a little ceramic bowl and I put in, I don't want to spill it, but I, if you can see, I put the kitchen oil in the bottom and then I just like shake. So, you know what, why don't I just show you right now? This is a new V6, so I'm just gonna take off the top. There's no science to this. It's just a little squirt of this. And take the thieves oil, and a little few shakes of this. And I like to do several drops where you can smell it, but it's diluted enough that it doesn't feel too hot on your child. If it feels too hot for them and they feel the heat, just add a bit more of the carrier oil. I spill it, spill it, I stir it around with my fingers and then I just slather it like I'm painting over their, their spine and their feet. You may wanna just put some socks on or something so they don't ruin their bed clothes. Um, but for us, that's what I need to be doing. And I don't really worry about the, the washing. I can deal with the washing another day. So those are some things to do with thieves and with your masks. You can even use a spray to spray down your masks, um, but that's something else. So all of those things have been in the stories and I'll come back with some of the other things that we will use, um, or most of you would like to use when it comes to going to school or going back to college.